really makes you think, gosh, we're, we're in Australia, because a lot about Australia is very familiar and very comfortable. So it is really nice to see. Yeah, once you hear it's difficult, it's, you don't realise you're like 10,000 miles away, because there's, there's nothing out of place than the UK. You don't realise until you see on the map, you know, how far you really are from the UK. Well, we've been here 13 months, um, and before that, about two or three years before that, we were living in Spain. Um, and we lived there for just over two years. But I, uh, I, we could, both couldn't get work there, although we really liked the lifestyle, the outdoor lifestyle and the climate. It wasn't a long-term solution because we couldn't both have a career out there. Um, and also, I didn't see much of a future for the children in a, in a Spanish country. Well, we decided on Australia because um, we liked the idea of the climate and the lifestyle. Um, so it was just, well, it's a big country, where, where do we go? So um, I actually went to the skills exhibition in London and talked to people from different states there about them. There's obviously lots of nursing jobs around, um, but I did spend some time talking to um, a stand on Victoria and the city of Greater Geelong had a contact there. And she was talking to me about visas and different types of visas and just advising me on what might be the best way to go. And that um, Geelong were offering a permanent residency visa um, that the, the job opportunities are there. She talked to me about the education, the job opportunities that there would be for Paul in Victoria and in Geelong. So that was it, wasn't it? It's a case mm. of, um, well, we might as well only live once, just go for it. So that, that was it. Mind made up. <laughs> Not on that. I've been really, really surprised at the children. And I think other people have as well, but they, they absolutely love school. They've settled really well. Um, and they've made, from day one, they were made to feel comfortable at school with the other children, really made an effort to make them feel welcome. And um, they just love it. I started work within a, well, probably a week of being week, here, I was yeah. straight, straight to work. So I was really focused on my, on my job. And people are very friendly in Australia and down to earth and, and sort of there's less of the hierarchy within a hospital that people are more down to earth and it's more first name terms where you might not get that in, in England. In Victoria, really lucky that we've got nursing ratios so that makes a big difference for sort of job satisfaction and um, you know, sort of stress levels and patient care. And we can, I mean we call us our home now, we would never think about going back to, to the UK. And um, we, we've decided to come here and this, this is our new life and we're going to stay. And um, we've got a lot of friends in the UK that would love to do what we've done, but the, the, the partner, other partner hasn't got 100% behind him or her, or they can't leave the ties of their friend and family. But me and Andrew have always been a bit the same, you know, let's go for it. You know, life's only once, so I'll make a go for it.